Black and white images on the computer screen are what doctors have been reviewing for years. This is the breastbone or the sternum. But pediatric cardiologists at UT Southwestern Medical Center have discovered a whole new world full of color. We can interact with the data and we can be inside it. Dr. Ashu Tandon and his colleagues partnered with computer scientists at UT Dallas and brought the technology to life. So this light blue is the right ventricle? A virtual reality, making interacting with a patient's anatomy possible. We can, for instance, go inside the left ventricle. The experience feels much like a video game. So if we can create an in-depth, immersive, interactive environment where they can see each patient's anatomy before they get to the operating room, hopefully that'll give them the opportunity to create the best surgical plan for any given patient's anatomy before they get there. It's complicated cases like Rowan Sanders that inspired Tandon's work. This energetic toddler has been fighting for her life since birth. It was scary and it was a really hard time, but it also, you know, it felt like every hour we were winning just a little bit. Rowan was born with four major heart defects, including a large hole in her heart. The virtual reality technology better prepared Rowan's surgeon, Dr. Camille Hancock Fryson, for her complicated case. She had a way of navigating her heart and creating a truly personalized plan before heading into the operating room. It gives you kind of this wave of peace of, you know, she hasn't done it on her, but she like knows what she's gonna do on her actual heart. So it, it was really cool. It's been more than a year since her first surgery and Rowan has gone through several additional heart procedures. But with a positive prognosis and new milestones reached each month, the Sanders are happy to be a healthy family of three.